Hey guys, it's Joel again. Um, today I wanted to do something just a little bit different. Um, well, well, not quite different, but um, got a different case of cars that I've collected. Uh, this is some of my DW collection. Um, so I'm still documenting my loose collection of stuff. So I'm still going through these cases. Um, these here are still Hot Wheels. And uh, if you give me one moment, I'm going to open up the case and try and uh, get some of the stuff to fall out. Uh, my cousin thinks it's funny, but it annoys me. Okay, so real quick, I just want to go through. Um, the VW collection, there's nothing really terribly fancy in here. Um, a lot of this stuff is probably mostly new. Uh, trying to see what year this one is. Uh, this came out in 2012. Okay. No. This is sort of like what the VW Beetle looks like now, okay, compared to this, which is the v Beetle Cup car, okay, and this one here has a copyright date of, let me see if it's in here, nope, I don't see a copyright date, but it's called the new Beetle Cup. Uh, the code on here is J22, last year was K, each side JK, so this is 2016. You can see in there that there is a roll bar, so it's a, it's a race one. Okay, this is just another version of this. At some point, I'll probably separate these out, but here are all the uh, combis that I've collected to this point. I can't tell. This might be the one from the Beetle series. This one right here. I'm not sure. So I think eventually what I'll do is I'll separate them out so I have all my VW Beetle Cups in one, you know, new Beetles in another, and so forth. Okay, Combis in another. Um, this one's a little bit old, and it's got, uh, I think this is from 1998, 99, somewhere in that neighborhood. This has got some weight because it's a metal base. Okay, and this one... Doesn't have the name on the bottom, but I think it's called the Baja Bug. So this one, this one here would probably be a good track car because of the weight and the fact that it's got the regular wheels and not the uh, the four by fours. But this is kind of a cool model. All right. Um, premium cars. This is the customized VW drag truck. Lift up back. This is from the uh, Star Wars series. And then uh, I bought this loose from uh, actually a guy not too far from me. Um, <clears throat> drag truck, the Army drag truck. Uh, and then I just recently purchased this. I now have one in the package too. There's another premium model. Kind of neat name on the side, guillotine for, and let me see here, I think this part comes off, there we go. Sorry about the noise, that's my uh, dogs getting excited, they're in the room with me. Uh, this does have real riders. I'm sorry, the dogs are up, uh, they're playing. 
So if you hear any noise, that's that. This is a... Hey, come here. This is a color changer. Plastic body. This is a Volkswagen SP2. Uh, I've never seen one of these cars. Um, I think they're <clears throat> sold in Brazil. And this is a premium, well, semi-premium, I guess. This was from the uh, a series that's only sold in Targets. Uh, these two are obviously the same with the moon eyes, which I kind of think is cool. Metal base. A couple more with that body style. This one, casting difference has a roof. This used to have an opening back. Here's the Gulf GTI. And then here's some uh, classic Hot Wheels Beetles. Uh, this one is uh, Herbie the Love Bug. This one came out a while ago. This one has. Yep, this one is a metal base. I think I bought this one loose because I don't remember the package it came in or what series it might be from. This one is the Surf and Cool series that came out a while ago. Uh, I think, I'm not sure what series this came from. Maybe somebody can let me know. And this is kind of a matte finish. So, got a couple Beetle convertibles. This is just known as the Volkswagen Beetle. Okay. I think I put in my German collection in here too. So here's another. Baja Beetle, but with different wheels. One moment, please. Sorry about that. <laughs> Let's see here. Where did a Baja Beetle go? You see the two different wheels or in this case I'm not concerned about the actual wheel itself but the different time tire this is like a hobby type tire here's the uh, the regular here is another plain beetle here's the Volkswagen Caddy Got a surfboard molded into the back. I don't know if you can see that or not. Kind of see it there, I think. It's a Volkswagen Caddy. There's, there's the Volkswagen Type. Can't read that. Hmm. Let's see if I can see it on the other one. Type 131, maybe. I think it's also known as the Volkswagen thing. Type 1. Looks like Type 181. Got three samples of that. And the rest.
rest of the case is actually my German collection. So these are Mercedes and uh, BMWs. So um, here's a BMW M4. Another M4. Classic. Take care of the top. Here's a Porsche 911 GT2. Here's from a couple years ago the Porsche 356 AL. Here's the Porsche 911 GT3 RS. I don't remember all these designations, especially from Porsche, the German manufacturers. This one has a code on the bottom, it's 2012, copyright date, H45. Uh, I actually don't remember what car that is, to be honest with you. maybe someone can tell me what this one is. Here we have a Porsche Panamera. One more Porsche. And here's one that I bought at my meeting. Uh, there's actually no copyright date on the bottom, and there's no name for the car, but it does have a has a metal base. Looks like a kid that had this at one point put his name or his initial on the bottom. Uh, I guess it's a Porsche 930. That's what it says on the side. Okay. Uh, I don't know when it came out. <clears throat> Here's another. Here's another Carmen Gilia. It's a duplicate. Porsche Carrera GT. And this one has a copyright date of 1989. Okay. Uh, but this did not come out in 89. That's a lot newer. Okay, now we can get down here to. I don't remember what Mercedes-Benz they call this, but that is a Mercedes. <clears throat> and I don't remember what Mercedes-Benz they call this. I don't know if that's a 500 SEL or what that is. But anyway, that's just a short video on my VW collection. Um, If you have any questions, comments, you know, uh, please feel free to uh, write. I hope you like the page or the video. And if there's anything else you want to see, um, let me know. Uh, thanks a lot. Take care.